let's talk about Cam Newton. Yeah. I didn't buy him for three years, and I don't know if it clicked, but I watched him the last three weeks, and I'm like, he's carrying that franchise. Like, what? how has he gotten better? What's he doing now that he didn't do three years ago? You know, I think he's – understanding that there are highs and lows of the game. And that's probably why people will get on him so much because he's all happy at the podium and he's celebrating and stuff like that. And that's great. I think, I mean, they're winning. Um, but he has to understand. And I think he understands now that he didn't in the past that you can lose and you have to accept the fact of the people coming at you when you do lose. Um, and that's the difference, I think, in Cam Newton now. He's matured. A lot. You see when he's talking to the, you know, at the podium and right. at, getting asked the questions at the game. He used to put a towel over his yeah. head and well, he pout. didn't want to talk. He didn't want to talk to anybody in a, in the past, and he just shied away from any question that was difficult. Um, and I think he's handling it well now, even with the criticism that uh, dancing, the, the dance and everything else. And you know, look, as long as he can accept the fact of, of when they lose, the people going to pile up on him more than ever because of the happiness and the smiling and, and, and the dancing he's doing. Uh, in the good times, as long as he can accept the fact that people are going to jump on him times 10 because of him celebrating doing things he's doing, he'll be fine. But he has a reason to be, and I think the people should lay off. They should lay off a little bit because when you're an undefeated team in the National Football League, you better be having the most fun you can have. And then smiling and dancing and, you know, whether the <laughs> dance is a five seconds, not you dance, you know, because that doesn't happen, um, especially to – a quarterback, how, how you just said, for the past three years. He began dog. Th- began dog. Didn't get respect that he did. Now he's not only got the respect, he's earned it. The team has earned it. Um, he just has to be ready that w- when, when they do lose. When, yeah, when they do lose and things go south. It's okay. It's okay. We lost the game because these next few weeks, it might be a hurdle or two. Sean, think about this. When's the last time they lost a regular season game? It's been a long time. Mid-season last year. I mean, honestly, John, when's the last time Carolina, they lost at Seattle. Yep, right. Cam Chancellor pick. They played very well. Yeah. When is the last regular season game Carolina lost? I bet you it's like week 13, week 12 of last year. We got If you don't believe them now, because I was a critic. It's like, right. I watched them this weekend. They're big. They're physical. They're through the trenches. When's it, if, did you find it, John? When is it? Yeah, week 13. 